Today I'm gonna to walk step by step through the analytics in Flowdesk for your workflows because it's so important to know your analytics to know how you can improve your workflows and get more clicks and get more conversions if you're trying to sell a product or get more people to subscribe or whatever you want to do. So first we're going to go to workflows in the top of the box. Then I'm gonna look at my side hustle funnel. So first I wanna point you to these little dots here. So here it's gonna give you analytics at the overview. So I have 1,125 total subscribers that have opted into this workflow. 112 people are currently in the workflow, so currently going through the emails, and then 1,013 people have completed it. So we can go to view details. This is gonna give you an at a glance. So total, the 1,125, active, completed, and then it also gives you opens and clicks. So I have 819 opens in 534 clicks shows you engagement so overall open rate is 72.8 percent of the entire funnel i have multiple emails in this funnel which i'm going to show you but on average 72 percent of people open it and on average overall click through rate is 47.5 percent which is awesome really great open by device so we can see that 34.2 percent of people open on mobile and it's 65.8 open on desktop which is actually pretty surprising i would think there would be more mobile opens but nope for this it is desktop then i can see bounces 22 bounces 74 unsubscribed and three were marked as spam so let's go into the details so this is the overall of the funnel. So you can see the opt-in, the trigger is a segment has subscribed to Side Hustle Ideas. Then here's the first email. Then we're gonna wait until it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, or Friday. We're gonna wait one day and wait until it's 10 a.m. to send the next email. And then the same thing. And then here's the third email. Here's the trigger one day delay. Fourth email, another one day delay. Fifth email wait two days, wait two days, and then another email, then a couple wait, and then another email, and then the final email. So I think there's seven emails total. So what we can do is we can go in here, this is the first email, and click the little analytics tab. So I can see that, like it said, 1,125 people have um, sent, the open rate for this one, the click rate, 43.6%. Then on this one, I can see here, the 560 people have sent, the open rate is 26.3 and the click rate is 1.6. So my open rate is always gonna be super high on the first one and a lot lower on the other emails because I'm giving them a freebie. So when they opt in and they go to my opt-in, here, let me actually show you. So we're gonna to go to freemanandbudget.com slash side hustle ideas. And so this is the freebie here. So they're gonna get this download when they put in their name and email address, and then it's gonna to trigger to send them the first email right after they send this email. So it's gonna be super high in the first one because they're getting that free download. So then the other click through rates are gonna be a lot lower. So 1.6, and this is 26.3% open rate. This next one, is a 25% open rate with a better click-through rate. So this one is actually better converting better to the clicks that I want them to, which is to go to my sales page for my course. Then my third one, 26% open rate, 2.2%. Now, if you're seeing an open rate that's super low, maybe, you know, two or 3%, 10%, whatever it is, lower than your average, then you know you need to change your subject. So this is gonna tell you what you need to change. So you need to either change the verbiage in the, in the where you're clicking on the links or the clicks or whatever it is or the signups, or do you need to change the subject? So this one, the subject is pretty good. Let's look at the next one. Recorded this video for you. This actually has a really high percent open rate and click rate for the video. This one, 36%, 2.5% click rate. And as you can see, the, the numbers of the center are changing. So 22% open rate, 1.6 click rate. That's not that great for clicks. So I probably wanna go in here and change my click rate a little bit. 
This one is 25% open rate, 1.5% click rate, and then subscribers who have completed the workflow. Then if you click on this, you're gonna see all the people that have subscribed to the workflow. And then you can also see, I have all their email addresses here, which obviously I'm blacking out for privacy, but then you can see when they entered the workflow, you can see the time and the date. So November 12th at 7.05, November 9th, 2.42 a.m., and all of the timestamps you can see there. So that is how you do analytics in Flowdesk. I do have a full playlist of Flowdesk videos. Let me know what other Flowdesk tutorials you want me to make, and I'd be more than happy to make them for you guys. And also, if you do want to try Flowdesk, I will have a link down below in the description for 50% off Lifetime, which is an amazing, amazing deal. So 50% off Lifetime down below in the description.